happen. Hey, everybody, another Brower Etude for you. This one is all about chord balance. We have all these really nice crunchy chords with uh, seconds and fourths all over the place. Good dynamic contrast through the entire piece. But really the focus of this is chord balance. Essentially, you should be able to play these chords in a way that either brings out a note or make sure that the chord is completely even. Let me show you what I'm talking about. Okay, so what I am, I'm a little bit farther back so you can see my hand because I didn't want to play way up here because you don't want to, but um, I got this first chord here, which is a D, an A, and a B, right? D, A, B, and we have this nice uh, second, right? Major second here in the, uh, in the chord. And we can play them all evenly. Or we can play with the second uh, a little bit louder. Right, so that we get that crunch, right? Uh, one of my teachers told me one time that Brower is all about the seconds, right? So we want this, the second to be louder. And then on the second chord, our F, G, and C, we want these notes to be louder, right? Because we want those seconds, so. So what we want to practice is to practice in a way that you get all the individual notes to come out. Okay, we want this one. All right. We want this one. Or we want this one. Right? The middle one is always the hardest one, but good practice for this etude. Very nice, simple one for this week, and I hope you all learned something. If you did, let me know in the comments below. If you enjoy content like this, give me a like. If you are not subscribed, please subscribe to me and hit the little bell icon so you know when I upload new videos. And as always, thanks for watching.